ladies and gentlemen, thrill six of all ages, coast of child hair, Doncaster born, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park newsroom update. This is from Holiday Park in Germany, and we now know the theme of their 2024 investment. Now, before we get started, make sure you do like, comment, subscribe, click that case post in the YouTube video. Subscribe if you're new around here, it really is important. Also, guys, check the description down below for social media links and the Google Forms link where you buy the camera can submit your own video ideas. And for now, guys, let's get straight into this and let's talk about Holiday Park and about their 2024 investment. So for 2024, Holiday Park is creating a top-class themed area themed to, to the Tomorrowland Festival. Now, where have we heard that before? Plopsa Land Japan. Now, Plopsa Land Japan recently invested in the Tomorrowland area and, of course, the Ride to Happiness, which is their Mac Extreme Spinning Roller Coaster. Now, to make way for this new uh, area will be the iconic water ski stunt show. Now, this is a very classic show at the park. It's been around for, for decades at the park, uh, but now it will officially, for the first time, be removed and demolished. It will make way uh, for this brand new uh, sort of investment. Now, for those of you who uh, need a good idea as to where you know this new area is and where this new area is taking place um, I've got something on your screen right about now which says to you exactly where the area is so we do have a statement from Steve van der Kerkhoff the managing director of the Popsa group which operates the Holy Park he says we are very proud to be able to expand our range of attractions in Germany together with Tomorrowland with the expertise of our own designers and the creative minds of Tomorrowland Festival we'll create an attraction and a top class themed area in the Holiday Park in the press release, the park highlights the result of a collaboration between the Belgian sister park Popsland Japan, uh, the Rider Happiness by Tomorrowland opening back in 2021. The coaster, the uh, Rider Happiness, is the first in Europe to combine a double catapult launch, multiple rollover elements and spinning gondolas together. Now, when announcing the new themed area, the company's left it open whether an extreme spinning coaster will also result from the cooperation with Tomorrowland in the Holiday Park. So the novelty will be on the former side of the iconic Holiday Park water ski stunt show. After 30 years, the era is coming to an end. For 30 years, guests could experience a water ski stunt show on a large lake in the amusement park from the Aqua Station, which is of course the site on your screen. It's a very big site. Uh, due to the coronavirus pandemic, it's not been possible to play the show for the past two and a half years. After such a long standstill, the structural and technical conditions of the entire area no longer meets the expectations of a contemporary show. And of course, there are videos on YouTube about the performance of the ski show, stunt show, so please go and check that out for your, for your memories. Comment down below in this video, guys, if you've been to see the stunt show, if you've got any memories of the stunt show as well. Now, Holiday Park always wants to offer its visitors new thrills. The new concept for the Aqua Stadium and the lake area has now been developed. After two years of standstill, though, the CEO says, despite all our efforts, it's too difficult to start the show again. So, the Aqua Station will make way for Tomorrowland. And now I'm going to share my thoughts on this new project. There we are, ladies and gentlemen, Thrill 6 of all ages. That is speaking about Holiday Park and the brand new Tomorrowland for 2024. Now, like I said, it's been left open to see whether they are going to include a Mac Extreme Spinning Roller Coaster. Now, Holiday Park for me is an exciting park in Germany. I think for the future as well, specifically, especially the future. Because they've got a lot of projects coming up. They've got a new water park, they've got a brand new hotel, they've recently opened the Dino Splash, they've recently opened, you know, all these new attractions and they've got these new attractions coming up off the park with the hotel and the water park. Now we've got this massive new area for 2024. You saw me do a video earlier about F telling about their new Dark Ride for 2024. 2024 seems to be coming together rather nicely right now. Um, Thought Park's new coaster, F telling's new Dark Ride, now this you know several elements 2024 are all starting to come together now and it's starting to feel like a really exciting year brewing in a couple of years time in 2024 um so yeah it's left open to the to the mind's eye whether we get a uh, extreme spinning coaster my hope me personally is i either want an extreme spinning coaster or i want something just as good in this particular tomorrow land because as we know 
cookie cutter areas and cookie cutter coasters aren't particularly my favorite if you're going to do an extreme spinning coaster at least make it somehow different to the one that pops on japan if you're going to do that if you're going to do that kind of coaster change the name change the layout quite a bit and then you'll have a winner make it unique from the other plops land make it unique i don't want to see an exact copy and an exact name an exact retheme of the plops land one because that's just copycatting so i want to hold the parks to be unique i want it to be different in some way new different name um different layout elements i want to see something completely different maybe a similar style of coaster but something different i'd like to see maybe the iconic jojo roll at the station uh and maybe more than two maybe, maybe two launches yes so apart from two launches of the jojo roll at the station i want to see some different elements i want to see something unique about it if it's going to be an extreme spinning coaster or go with something that's not an extreme spinner but maybe it's the same i don't even go with the same name to be honest i go with a different name either way so or maybe you go with uh a traditional mat launch coaster a multi-launch coaster and do it like that um i mean that might be an idea maybe they go for a different manufacturer maybe they go with someone completely different to mat rides maybe they go with something like uh, an intermin coaster or something like that so uh, you know there's a million different one possibilities at this stage but um I think it's going to be really interesting. I think it's going to be interesting to watch. So what's this space? Stay tuned for any more updates on this new area. But yeah, this is the start of yet another new project. And this is why I love being primarily a theme park news channel. Because you move on from projects like the, the Poulton's Park with the Tornado Springs and the Ten Looper from England, which is approaching its conclusion now in the next few months. You know, you move on from all those projects, Williams World, Alton Towers, and then you're moving into new projects, you know, this new area at Holiday Park for 2024. And between now and 2024, we will be covering every step of the way on this project. So, that's going to be it, guys. My name is Coast Chow, Kill on the Coast Life. I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a tomorrow-land-tastic day.